Welcome back to an introduction to basic concepts of maintenance and reliability. In this lecture, we are going to discuss types of lubricant films, which is an important concept to grasp in the field of maintenance and reliability. It is because lubrication is part and parcel of majority of mechanical equipment. The purpose of a lubricant is to reduce friction between mating elements or components of a machine. This is achieved by a film of lubricant holding itself between the sliding surfaces. The lubricant prevents the interlocking of microscopic crests and troughs of the two surfaces and it allows for a smooth sliding and reduces wear and tear. This is what is called a boundary film lubrication. Lubricant remains on the boundary of the mating surfaces. The load is carried partly by the film of lubricant and partly by direct surface contact. Now let's look at another type. In a journal bearing, the film of lubricant is not just there to cover the crests and troughs, but it does not let any part of the shaft to come into direct physical contact with the bearing. The lubricant oil is pressurized enough to maintain a thick film of lubricant such that the shaft keeps rotating in the lubricant without ever touching the boundaries. This type of lubricant film is called full film lubrication or thick film lubrication. That is, the shaft never touches the housing and lubrication is not present just between the crests and crofts, but it keeps the two surfaces physically separated from each other. Thick film lubrication is further divided into two types. This example of journal bearing we just gave comes under hydrodynamic lubrication, that is, the type of lubrication in which the film is thick enough to keep the two parts away from each other. However, there is another interesting type. It is called elastohydrodynamic lubrication. In elastohydrodynamic lubrication, it is not the thickness of the film that separates the sliding surfaces. It is the elasticity of the material of the two parts that does that job. The rotation of parts creates pressure points that form localized microscopic deformation in the metal surfaces that restores elastically once the pressure is removed. This deformation creates separation between the sliding surfaces. Finally, mixed film lubrication is a cross between boundary film lubrication and hydrodynamic thick film lubrication. While the bulk of the surfaces are separated by a lubricating layer, some part of the surfaces do make contact with each other as in boundary lubrication. So these were the main types of lubrication films that maintenance and reliability professionals should be aware of. Let us conclude our discussion here and we'll see you in the next lecture.